Greetings all, a devious monkey here. Okay, it's 10 after seven Sunday night. I got a shit ton of day job stuff that I procrastinated about, so I need to do it tonight and get it done. At least I've done laundry and I just ate dinner because I was getting hangry, but I have been putting off and putting off and putting off doing certain things. In the meantime though, that's sent me in a lot of different directions and I've done a lot of other stuff. You can see different lighting here. Well, you know I have all these Aperture MC lights everywhere, so I'm using four of them for the studio, and then I have two that I've been just sort of storing down there. So they've just sort of been sitting down there, and I thought to myself, you know what? I see all these creators, they're always doing like this whole like pink and blue, you know, Miami Vice and my world stuff. I've got them sitting here, I might as well do it. So I redid the lights, and I actually had to pair them and, and set them and do all that shit. So I got that done, so you get different lighting today. That was because of procrastination, because I wanted to do that rather than my day job work. I also took out the arm, the shitty wobbly arm that I was using for a while for my overhead cam stuff that didn't work worth a shit. And I also got this thing, which is like a uh, an iPad or tablet holder that goes in, in your cup holder in your vehicle and that's what I was using in my Tahoe for a long time. It is it is rickety and messed up but I thought to myself I can get the iPad off my desk when I'm doing work if I can figure a way to get this arm connected to make that work. So I also did that as uh, procrastinating from doing my day job work. There pretty much isn't anything that I haven't done today that hasn't been procrastination to keep me from doing the day job stuff. If I had mentioned I'm procrastinating and I don't want to do my day job stuff. So this is going to be a quick video. I just wanted to let you know about that. Now, I've also come to another conclusion today. Again, as I always say, talking with the Yankee Cowboy, and we were going back and forth and enabling each other to go out and buy more shit. And we kind of got to the point where I showed him about the deal that I got on the Sigma 24 to 72.8. Yeah, F2.8. And I sent him a link to it, and he's like, oh, damn it, dude. So he ended up getting that as well. And then I said, you know, I'm done with lenses for the foreseeable future because I've already spent so much money. But the, I think the next thing I wanted to get was the 35 1.4. And he's like, why? You already have that. You're going to have it as soon as you get your 24 to 70. And there isn't going to be that much of a difference in bokeh if you're using the 2.8 instead of the 1.4. And the more I thought about it, the more I thought, okay, I, I need to not just go out and start buying all kinds of lenses and shit that I don't need, which is what I had done before, which is why I sold everything, and also why I keep my APS-C lenses down to what I've got now. Now that I'm getting all uh, full-frame Sony stuff, I have it pared down to exactly what I'm gonna do, and they're all Sigma lenses. I'm not buying any Sony lenses for the full-frame. So now that I have my A7R4, I got that with the 85 1.4, which is gonna be my, my go-to portrait lens, and then I got the 100 to 400, which will be for other shit. And then I, I had to get the 24 to 70, which I was gonna get anyways, just because of the deal that I got and the extras that came with it. And I'll talk about that after I get them, which they should be here tomorrow. Then I thought, he's right, I don't need that 35. But what I was gonna originally get and what I now am going to get, and then I'm done with full frame lenses, is the Sigma 14 to 24, 2.8. That gives me super wide angle, the workhorse 24 to 70, and the 100 to 400 for any telephoto stuff I need. And then I have my 85 for portrait stuff. So that's it, that's all I'm gonna do. I have figured all that out over the past couple of weeks, culminating with today of deciding not to get a 35, but to just get the 14 to 24 eventually, not anytime soon. I don't need it anytime soon for anything that I wanna do right now, but it's gonna be the last lens that I get. And then I'm gonna be done with all the gear for all the cameras. And, and again, I wasn't expecting to get you know, the A7R4 and the full frame lenses and all that kind of stuff. But that opportunity had come along and other stuff came together that just made it possible. So now all these lenses that I have or will have can be used with all three cameras. Now I just have to get cracking on the content and setting up photo shoots and, and you know, getting out there. So I've already spoken to one person, which I had said in the other video, I think yesterday. So we're gonna be meeting up on Tuesday and we're gonna be discussing plans going forward and, and you know, what we wanna do 
and I'm, I'm stoked about that and that's just gonna spur me to reach out to more people so if you're watching this and you're in the Virginia North Carolina ish area and you want to shoot let me know drop me a line Okay, that's it. That's all I got. I really need to get cracking on the day job stuff so that I'm not sitting here at freaking 11 o'clock tonight doing these updates. If you have any comments, questions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Like, subscribe, and all that shit. And remember, kids, forward and up.